And Chris Ockley here, 2012 MIAA champs with uh, Central Missouri multi-event superstars, uh, Lindsay, uh, Lindsay Ledow and Aaron Aliwine. And great weekend for you guys, super busy. I, um, but I know I had to be disappointed when, when they hand that team trophy to Lincoln. Tell me about those feelings. The initial reaction is to be a little disappointed. I think that disappointing feeling came when we knew we wouldn't have it before the game was over. Then afterwards, I mean, there was no more sadness, no more disappointment because of how well we did through the meet. Um, we really shined in a lot of places we didn't even expect to, so we, can't. we have to keep our heads up. Very proud of our team. You know, we, we can pull together. We did. We did pull together. And, um, you know, you say, I don't know, we have outdoor. Yeah. We're going to keep going. Well, and I mean, it's not like you're losing to, you know, your, you know, two of the top programs in the country. So it's. And even a 140 or however many points you guys racked up is, is phenomenal. But what do you guys, I know, come in, you know, when you start fall conditioning and then you start to get in the season, do you look forward to conference when you know your coach is going to be writing you in for all those events and all those, you know, jumps and every every start block time you get in the box? Do you look forward to that or what? It's a fun team. You yeah. Know? yeah. Sometimes they got to take one. Yeah, it's, it's for the team. Conference is for the team. It is. Um, we'll have the opportunity to come back out in two weeks and just completely go for it as yeah. individual athletes. You know, we have potential to do well as a team at nationals as well, but here it's whatever we're called to do. And you guys, it's not like that's nothing new. You guys have racked up several trophies and and been close, uh, even even national, so close lately. But um, tell me, and I get so, this meet's so fun every year, whether it's here or at Orangeburg. Just the atmosphere is amazing, and I try to tell high, you know Missouri High School and athletes and coaches to come because the atmosphere is phenomenal and just the rivalry and the camaraderie is just amazing. What? Tell me just about a little bit about the atmosphere and the experience every year at this meet. It's exciting. It's very exciting, especially Sunday, um, all the final races, you know, closing things up, seeing where you're going to fall, mm -hmm. getting cheers going, chants going. Right, it, yeah. It really gets you jacked up. Right? Yeah. It's really fun. Yes. Yeah. Well, you get to... Take, I guess, what, a couple, let's see, well, let's talk about how today went. Let's see, first and second, let's see, on Friday in the, in the uh, pentathlon, and you guys are both got automatic points, you're going, and tell me about the, uh, let's see, long jump was first today, and then how did that go? Pretty well. It was okay, yeah. You know, no, no complaints, yeah. Um, I jumped a little farther than I have yet this year, so I was happy about that. Um, we could have gone a little bit farther, but we can't be disappointed with how we did because it was, it was a good event. It's it's kind of a swing it, event. It swung in our favor. Yes, so it did. No complaints. Yeah, and you didn't improve, but I mean, a 194 almost this yeah. year, earlier this year. Yeah, that was my that was my excitement for the weekend. Yeah. And, uh, I hadn't ever jumped maybe 19 once before, and I hit yeah. auto. So yeah. Very very exciting. Very exciting. And I know the high jump was very highly contested. Tell me, tell me about that and how that went. Um. Well, I almost got out at 5.5. Five. Yeah, I heard it was really fun to watch. Yes. Um, it was fun. It was hard. Yeah, it was. <laughs> at no point did it just play out kind of how no. you thought it would. Right. There was some. Aaron had a, a third attempt clearance. Yes. And then when the bars got high, we stepped up and made the first time. attempt clearances. Yes. That's and very, very important at that time. It very got us really important. excited. And Take first and second. Both coach had you stop it after both clearing, what, 5.8 and a quarter? Or three quarters. Okay. Um, and tell me, that was pretty exciting and emotional. I know you guys were after coming down and running around the coaches and teammates. Tell me about that. What that, you know, when it's on, you know, it's that close to being done, and then to clear it, and what's what are those emotions like? I was crazy. I was jacked. Yeah. No. I'm very excited. Um, I had I jumped an inch farther than I have, which will get me qualified. I wasn't before, so I'm so excited about that. Mm -hmm. In practice, every once in a while. I felt really good. It just I put it together. felt simple. I just hadn't put it together in a meet yet, and it felt awesome to do it here. Now it's time to do it. Yeah. And it worked you out. Need to tell my, my feelings were about just okay. I got a little nervous when I started missing bars very early, and you know, and I was so happy I was able to just put it together. You know, just put my foot down, and I did what I needed to do, and that's what we need to do for the team. So. And what's it like when you have a teammate there too? To oh, you know, it's not like you're out there. 
dancing together is one of the best things, you know? And it would have been awesome. Do, yeah, do, yeah. do the pen, do the long jump, do the high jump. There's Pulling on each other. three or four central girls all together. So yeah. She pulls me helps. through. <laughs> and I didn't realize you had so much uh, sprint endurance with four, four by four, you know, 400 and yes. 600, 600 yeah. yards, so. It was fun. Yeah. It was definitely yeah. new. I'd never run the six before until this weekend, so. Yeah. It was definitely, it's a race. That's yeah. For dang sure. You gotta, gotta pull from within on that one. So you recover, and then when you look at look ahead a couple of weeks, just uh, any specific goals, or just try to compete and be on when it, when it matters, and see how it goes. Go get it. The best you can in every single event. You know, see how well we can put it together. I'd love to say, <laughs> I'd like to get a national championship again. That's a goal. If I score, you know, a huge PR, what I'm looking to score, and I still get eighth, then I can't. Really be disappointed, but yeah. we're just gonna come out and be ready to shine in everything. I'm just hoping the PR is well. Have Have you competed in, at Minnesota at Mankato? I haven't no. Yet, okay. So yeah. Well, I'm hoping to make the trip and find find somebody's floor, maybe some nice Minnesotan <laughs> to let me crash on their floor and make the trip. But uh, um, I'm sure you, I'm sure that's probably a couple days away to think about. I'm sure you guys are exhausted and ready for <laughs> ready to. Well, yeah, we'll take it. Some days for recovery and then start back on it. And yeah. Eventually get ready to go again. Gatorade and try to get the go. teammates on the bus ride home to uh, or the people mover to a uh, to little so. massage <laughs> on the legs, prop up nice. the legs we'll and the feet. Nice. And, yeah. Nice. Well, congratulations, ladies. I know it's been a busy weekend and uh, keep it up and hopefully more of the same in two weeks. Absolutely.